The wildflowers of Yorubadala are both varied and colourful. Just south of Batemans Bay, this huge collection of wildflowers is growing at the Yorubadala Regional Botanical Gardens. It's spring and the wildflowers are in full bloom. Trish Ellis gives me an indigenous insight to these plants. Trisha, this plant's had a very interesting name. Uh, Xanthorea is the botanical name. Uh, black boy bush, most people refer to it as, and um, Aboriginal people in the local language, the Duriga language, known, it's known as Minga. It certainly has a lot of uses for the Aborigines. Absolutely. This actually was the spear shaft that was used. Obviously it has to be a lot taller than that, but it will, um, the men would usually affix a Silcrete spearhead to it. And there's some fancy tastes here. There is. If you run your hand down there, it's not quite the right season yet, but you can have a look at your hand. It tastes a little bit like honey. It's just sweet. It's only just started to get the taste. And down on the leaves here. And down on the leaves, when you pull the new shoots out of the leaves, you can only get it out if it, if it comes out easy. Yep. Then you can chew on the end of it. Doesn't really have any taste. It just stimulates your saliva and it helps to keep your mouth moist so that you don't dehydrate. 